the Pescador Pilot. The Pescador Pilot is an affordable sit-on-top, packed to the gills with fishing features, and complete with the Pilot Drive pedal system. The optimized gear ratio in the Pilot Drive allows for effortless, all-day, hands-free cruising, so you can keep your lure in the water longer. The quick key system makes it easy to engage and disengage the drive quickly to zero draft, making launching and docking a breeze, while the custom-designed turbo flaps reduce noise and keep turbulence to a minimum. Forward and reverse motion paired with easy grip, low profile rudder steering control allows for a super tight turn radius, offering all around maneuverability in those hard to reach places. A recess in the hull stores the lightweight drive while not in use, and the center scupper lid allows for easy transportation and storage. In addition to the drive system, the Pescador Pilot has all the fishing features a serious angler could want including a stadium-style comfort-focused captain's chair with on-the-fly adjustability to fit a range of heights. Bow storage pods with a transducer scupper provide a secure place for gear and electronics. Pre-installed inserts for transducer mounting and precisely placed inlet outlets for direct wiring to the transducer scupper and display make electronic install a breeze. The Pescador Pilot also comes loaded with two Yak Attack gear tracks with easy mounting points for all accessories. Inside this bag is an entire kayak and paddleboard. Let me show you how it works. It's got four separate inflation valves. Three up front, one the tail. So once inflated, the Lono forms a unique kayak shape. It's got two front high side flared bowels, keeps the cockpit high and dry. Front pierces through the water extremely efficiently. And underneath the seat, you got a lot of room for storage. On the front of the hole, we've integrated a keel which runs almost halfway down the underside of the kayak. One, it's gonna paddle more efficiently. Two, it's gonna save the bottom from abrasion. The Lono comes with a traditional fin setup, similar to most of our paddle boards. It has two small side bites and a larger center fin box. It's incredibly useful for paddling. It gives you tracking and stability. The seat's also incredibly unique. It's developed with our drop stitch inflatable core material as well. It integrates with a male female vinyl slide track, similar to that of marine curtains. The seat simply detaches with G-hooks and can be slid right out of the track. Bingo. You can even use it as a life preserver if you wanted to. The seat is attached to the deck of the Lono with two seat supports. On the rear of the seat, we've also included an additional G-clip and webbing for securing the seat upright and also for securing the rocket rack when it's installed. The Lono's deck is also secured to the bottom through two seat supports. This provides additional rigidity and structure to the deck for the paddler. What's cool is this chamber here. You can remove it completely, and if you're hanging out in some shallow water or with your friends at a sandbar, you can float it. Uh, it'll hold the cooler. It'll actually still hold the rod holder, so you can sit there and have a mobile little bar to hang out and have fun at. The Lono comes standard with two rack receivers included. The rocket rack, which is for additional purchase, will hold four rods behind you. You can use it for trolling or simply storing rods upright behind you out of the way of paddling. Got a couple goodies on the front of the Lono. We've got a Scotty dot so you can attach a GoPro. Two small D-rings so you can do some low speed towing. We've included a few of our staples, bungee cords, keeps your gear safe. Got them on the front and on the tail. So we've coated the Lono with our super comfy EVA traction pad. Lono also comes with two rack receivers. These can be used to install either our bucket rack or tackle rack options should you choose to do so. The Lono comes standard with two side detachable pockets. Fill them with whatever you bring with you, and they're there when you need them. A lot of kayak paddlers like to bring coolers with them for various reasons, so don't worry, we got you covered. The kayak is covered like a porcupine and handles. The one up front is useful for towing it out of the water. The ones on the side are great for carrying or lifting yourself back inside. The ones on the rear are also good for pulling it in and out of the water. Multiple options. The Power Pole Micro is not included, it's an additional unit, but it's extremely helpful for shallow water anchoring wirelessly. Included is the sand spear sheath. It allows our accessory, the sand spear shallow water anchor, to integrate with the Lono. We've included paddle lashings on both sides, so you can store your paddle out of the way, or if you have two paddles, a sup paddle or a kayak paddle, you can store one while the other one's in your hands. In kayak mode, we suggest you use a 240 to 260 length kayak paddle. It's better for wider kayaks such as the Lono. 
Another great feature of the Lono is the open transom. As you paddle, water runs out the back. What's cool is it converts from kayak to stand up. All I gotta do is take this top panel off. Voila, we got a stand up board. It's a paddle board with sides. In fact, personally, I think it actually is the best paddling paddle board we make. So people ask, what is a Lono good for? There are multiple answers for that. It solves portability. You can put it in your car trunk, you don't need a trailer, you don't need roof racks. Secondly, it's light. Compare this to any rotomotor kayak, it's gonna be at least half the weight. Third, it's incredibly durable. You can beat it up with a bat, slam it into the ground, drag it across the parking lot, the Lono is gonna take the beating. We think that's pretty cool. It's 12 foot six inches long, 35 and a half inches wide, and will hold up to 400 pounds capacity, rider and gear included. Standing in front of the PK-13 pedal drive kayak. The PK-13 is 13 feet long, 33 and a quarter inches wide, weighs 80 pounds, and has a weight capacity of 550 pounds. The PK-13 comes equipped with a front carry handle for easy transportation. You have the front triangle storage system, which I mostly use as a cooler. It comes with the self bailing scupper. And is secured with the bungee tie down system. The PK-13's pedal drive system, it has an instant reverse function. So as you're pedaling forward, if you want to stop, just go backwards. The PK-13 speed ranges from three to five miles an hour, depending on the exertion you'd like to get. Furthermore, it comes with the splash card, which dubs as a cup holder and a tackle tray. The PK-13 has nine scuppers, six in the cockpit, two in the rear, and one in the front storage. Here you can see accessory mounting brackets so that you don't have to drill into the kayak. It comes pre-drilled for most sizes. You can fit articulating rod holders, uh, fish finder mounts, and the like. The PK-13 seat is set on a rail system so that you can adjust for all rider sizes. Kids of all ages and adults of all sizes comfortable. The two side carry handles are extremely durable and make it easier for transportation and moving the kayak around. You have a hand controlled rudder system for easy maneuverability. Also this kayak comes equipped with three flush mounted rod holders with covers to keep out any stagnant water. We have a round storage hatch with insert and these it's a through hatch so you can clean the inside of the kayak and access this area uh, quite easily. As you can see the PK-13's large storage area can fit multitude of items. Our 45 liter and our 20 liter cooler fit easily in here. What I love to do is with the 20 liter cooler I want to bring one of my smaller guests. The 20 liter cooler, the BKC 20 liter cooler matching gray camo. I pop it right down here and now I have an extra seating for one of my smaller guests. They love it. Towards the rear section here you'll see an additional rear carry handle, really durable, really secured in there tight and you as well have drainage should you ever want to clean the inside of the kayak. It's an easy way to drain it out. Underneath you'll see the flush mounted rudder so you don't have to worry about any debris or rocks in the water. And one of my favorite things about the PK-13 is the cockpit area. I walk around this cockpit, you can see from the diamond pattern, this is meant for standing up. Very stable for casting, for fishing, uh, just for even standing up and stretching your legs. Uh, this kayak is meant for an all day trip and very comfortable. So just know I ain't no regular fool Could be anything in the world But I can never be you Because I stand tall like I'm on my tiptoes Baby, you think a little too small I got big goals, baby Hey, where the money? Yeah, look, I just need the info Pronto, I go and get it And split it with my kinfolk daily And I'm the type of new. Yeah, my 
change my number on you. Yeah, that's how you react when people took the slumber on you. Pretty brown skin, baby, I can see the summer on you. You see all the bread, and I know it make you wonder, don't you, don't you, don't you? Ooh, I ain't surprised at all. Seen them rise and fall. Went up the mountain, it wasn't hard to climb at all. At the top, I found some relief. I finally got some peace.